Well, I can see my comments now. So guys, is this working? If so, please let me know. This is the very first time. We are live. Thank you. Okay, guys. Welcome to the stream from a sunny, sunny, hot, 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 Kyoto. The heart of traditional Japan. And today we have a very, 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 oh, I'm going to take this off for a second. We have a special stream lined up for you. I have a special stream lined up for you. First of all, <laughs> we are going to go and get changed here at the rental kimono store, Biwa Kimono. And actually, they literally, while I went in and did the uh, the meeting with her, they said they got a booking of a lot of customers in this morning. So we kind of need to be quick um, because there's only two members of staff in today. And so I can show you what's up. Now, there is one thing I used to keep saying that um, you you only wear yukata in summer. I did not know this. There is a type of summer kimono that is like a brand, like I didn't know about this. So there is yukata, and then there is now also a summer kimono. And I heard about this one. So let's find out about this. And oh my gosh, we're having a lot of hype coming in here right now. Guys, thank you so much for the support. I didn't even know you could gift subscriptions on YouTube. This is, this is all new. <laughs> thank you, Kitsune. I didn't even know this was a thing. Okay, we're learning things as we're going along. Everyone coming in, welcome. Thanks so much for turning up for the stream. I'm not sure what you can see on screen. My screen is currently going wild with all of your support. Thank you so much, Obudi as well. Thank you so much, Kitsune. And everyone here, thank you so much for the support and the stuff. I didn't even know you could do all these fancy new things. YouTube keeps finally implementing some new good changes, which I'm very, very, very happy about. <laughs> Michael, thank you also for the support. Marshall, thank you for the support. Oh my gosh, I didn't even know you could give gift subs. It's a real life hype train. Choo choo, it is. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is already new. I'm like looking at the screen. I didn't even know this was a thing. Thank you guys so much. I didn't, didn't see this coming at all. Oh my gosh. Ryan got a, got a gift too. Ryan Woodlock. Oh my gosh. All right, cool. Well, guys, guess this is happening right now. You can tell by my face. I'm already a little bit red and blot too because it is so, so hot here in Kyoto right now. And let's not make the staff wait, guys. Let's show what I was talking about. So um, I thought up until now, and I kept saying that on my channel so many times. <laughs> so uh, I saw on my channel so many, 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 many times. I thought that uh, only yukata are the only summer kimonos that I wore. So these ones are kimonos, right? Right, guys? And then we have yukata, which are like cotton fabrics, right? Ooh, thank you, Chris Slice. So you have yukata, which are like cotton fabrics. And these ones are the most common ones you see in summer. They're much more lighter to wear. You don't have to layer them up. And guess what, guys? I didn't know, but there's even, there's even more. <laughs> there's even more oh my gosh thank you guys so much for all the support that's happening here right now i don't even know if i'm if i'm seeing this right if i'm catching this right i i'm totally amazed by all of you guys right now thank you so much um Oburi, kitsune age guy era I, I didn't know this was a thing thank you guys i think they, they they're, they're taking a slice out of the twitch book here right now aren't they <laughs> rockphonic hi everyone okay yeah, that's news to everyone, right? You and I, we're all exploring this as, as we're speaking here right now. You, a, a completely new YouTube feature. Well, there we go. I haven't streamed on YouTube in a while. It's really nice that you guys managed to come here. I do appreciate that. So um, as I mentioned before, these are the big kimonos, right? And they have like that thick fabric. This is, by the way, a guy kimono, and it's so cool. Look at the, the fish, the koi king, <laughs> the goldfish. Your kittens love you back. I love you too. Thank you all so much for coming in. So since it's silk, it's usually very thick, right? And that's why in summer, a lot of people wear yukata. Just remember that word. And then I talked with the staff the other day while I was here. And they said there's other real summer kimono and they are made of silk. And those ones are these ones here. And if you look closely, I'm not sure if you can see that with the light, you can see my hand through a little bit. It's a really thin kind of see-through mesh. How cool is that? So it's kind of like a see-through silk mesh material. So these ones are actually super, super high class. So the yukata is like the, any, anyone can afford it. Anyone can just put it on kids and stuff. Um, 
level, but these ones here are actually made of like a, with a certain material and with a certain, I mean, breeziness that are some equipment. So they're still made out of silk. So here we go. It's, it's very, 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 very interesting to see. I've never seen those. Like you literally can see through. I'm not sure if you can see through, but you can, you can pretty much see the light go through the sleeves. Now I'm actually very curious. If she dresses me that, how much do you actually see through? I was <laughs> just a bit curious about that. So we're going to find that one out too. <laughs> what happens when I put that one on? Now with kimonos, you have to make sure that they actually fit you. And I had picked out this one, but it was a bit too small. Um, the sleeves were too short and it wouldn't go around to my juicy hips. So we had to find something that would go around to my juicy hips. Because they, they hip them, them hips don't lie. We are down with the thickness, but uh, apparently that, that, that kimono was not down with the thickness. So, <laughs> so I am curious how that is going to look when I put it on. Yeah, this is definitely, so this is, I've never tried any of these. Yukata, if you come to Japan, you don't mistake them. There's kimono, summer kimono, and yukata. And I, I always used to say a yukata is like a summer kimono, but a summer kimono and a yukata are two different things. So this is the new thing that I learned and that you guys are now learning with me, okay? These ones here, these, these silken summer kimonos that are like see-through with a really, really sheer material, those are summer kimonos. I guess we got it down now, right? Okay. <laughs> I was confused too. I'm so confused. So yeah. <laughs> I assume we're going to wear a layer underneath it. She said, also, yeah, if I'm, if I'm changing you, what are you going to do with the camera? I'm like, I can't stop it and start on YouTube. So, <laughs> you got some starting on YouTube. So, I will have to put you guys to the side and you guys have to chat a little bit for a second amongst each other while I'm putting on my Yukata underwear. And then in my Yukata underwear, you can watch me. A Yukata is not for guys. Not just for guys, is what, what one of your comments uh, I just saw pop up in the chat. A yukata is girls and gentlemen. A hakama is like a, a, a other type of thing. There's a, like many, many different types. But today, I want to make sure that I don't confuse you with all the details that we have. I just want to yukata, kimono, summer kimono, those three. There is many, many more types of kimonos here in Japan or of Japanese traditional wear. And I can't go through all of them today. But today we want to find out what this one here is, because I have never worn it. And I'm pretty sure you have never heard about these ones here before as well. So let's find out. Everyone coming into the stream. Hi, guys. Hi, guys. Hi, 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 hi. It's wonderful to see you. Please feel greeted, each and every one of you coming in here right now. But I also have to dash a little bit and make sure that we start getting ready before, before, the, um, before the customers come, right? We want to make sure that we don't we don't block up the space before the customers come. So I, ideally, I want to get changed and be ready before they pop in. So let's do that now, okay? Hi, Zha. Oh my gosh. Hi. Okay, she's currently still getting ready. So this is the one we picked out in the end. I thought it would look really nice, look really nice and classy, and we would find out how see-through this thing actually is. Hey. So yeah, this one is the see-through one, and she said, "Oops." There we go. I think, there we go. The further I get into the store, sorry guys, yep. The further I get into the store, the more, the less the um, the internet reaches you guys anyway. So this is probably gonna be quite good that, that I moved you over here. So you should be able to see the setup of the store right now. All right. So this is my black kimono that we've um, picked out. Let me quickly show you the sash. Okay. So <laughs> I was just gonna show you this. Now for Yukata, the thing in the middle, the big bell, the obi is super simple. But for the summer kimonos, she said this is a summer kimono specific sash belt. So the Orbi here, this is a normal one, which is really thick and really heavy and probably absolutely not, not breathable. Well, this one here is done with a certain like special mesh material. Like I can, again, it's sheer, you can see through it and you can see a different layer. You see that? And on the other side, 
it has like gold and silver on so this is pretty pretty oppressive in my opinion i'm pretty oppressed by this to be honest so let me just quickly see so yeah she's she's at the same time she's like tidying up the stool and getting everything ready for the other customers that are coming out so we have to we really have to dash a little bit trying to make sure do, 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 do. let me quickly see what you guys are writing oh okay okay right <laughs> okay guys well in that case i'm gonna go now go in go in get changed i'll see you guys in a second please chat along amongst each other and once i come out i'll come out you'll you'll see things are gonna be nice all right let's flip you guys around um on that note thank you chris Triet, for the five dollars thank you and uh has anyone of you ever worn a kimono? Which would you pick? Yes. All right. Let's go. <laughs> Let's pick this here one carefully up and bring it back to the changing room. And then I come and pick you guys up, okay, in a moment. So I just don't want you to see my undies. I don't think that, that needs to be on stream. So, But you're going to hear me still, hopefully, when I go over here. お願いします。もうあの下にある程度なったら、生配信ここの中に持ってきたいと思いますので、え、ここにもっとね、靴下の着るんですね。そうですね、夏は大きいものになるんで、一応こっちが。Okay, so for in summer usually you don't wear socks with your yukata, but with your kimono, you probably do. Oh, I didn't know. Okay, that's some nifty socks. <laughs> there we go. Let's make this happen. All right, see you in a sec. はい。はい。there we go. This is like ASMR now. Okay, there's always a little bag in which you can put your clothes. And then they leave that at the store. There's a number with it. And then with that number, you know when it's your turn. All right. I need now my under my kimono underwear. Hi. Okay. So there's like one sheer white layer that you wear underneath. To be honest, that one is already still very see through. So I'm not quite sure at which point I'll uh, pull you guys back into the, the street. It looks a little bit safer for me. Wait a second. Actually, it might be okay-ish. I'll pop out and quickly poke, poke my head out. I have actually no idea if you guys can see or hear me. My stream dropped for a moment. Let's see. I'm just going to double check if you guys can see or hear me. Okay, did it work? Could you guys hear me talk? We see Aunt here, you're fantastic. Okay, that's good to know, that's good to know. <laughs> so yeah, good, all good, all good. Hey, it seems like it's working well, guys, I'm glad. Okay. <laughs> so yeah, this, this is the setup here that we got going. The auto was fine the whole time. Good, thank you for mentioning that. That is super good to know. So yeah, this is like the, the first kimono layer that you wear, kind of, this is like, in theory, this is underwear, so 
currently seen me in my underwear. Scandalous. Scandalous. Okay, I'm Well, let's go. I'm going to sneak past him. Whoosh. And what I can see around me here, because you guys want to be able to see it. Hi, that's all this here. We're fixing the shape of this one here, of the underwear part. Everything needs to fit properly for the next layer to come on top. There's a lot of folded towels, um, small little folded towels that she's putting together right now to give myself that kind of um, straight, like a drum. You're kind of trying to make yourself as straight as possible. And since I'm a curvy girl, we kind of have to balance out my hips because they ain't lying. And my chest, we have to balance that out by putting several layers of towels around my waist to try as much as possible balance out my my chest with my waist um so make it all one straight line so i know in western cultures it's a thing that you generally try and emphasize your your hips or, or your chest well in japanese cultures you're kind of trying to more hide that um you hide that a lot more especially with the traditional clothes so we're putting some towels around my waist right now Ooh. I think I'd over it a little bit as a corset, but instead of like pushing pushing out certain body parts, it's kind of trying to make it all straight into one line. So you're supposed to be just like a straight round drum, I guess. <laughs> all right. Okay, this. Okay, now I. <laughs> I have more going. Oh, I got the same as. Okay, the next layer is now a silken kimono underwear. It already. I think that's the kind of stuff that some people, especially in America, would wear as if it was like a kimono nightgown. That's pretty much how it looks. I wonder if I have connection in this room. That's the only thing. The last time I was streaming from here, we had actually kind of okay connection in this room. Um, when I just went in today, I got some buffering. So I might have to move you guys around a little bit until we get to good reception. Hi. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. あ、どうなんですね。オッケー、オッケー。じゃあ、あの、スキン、あの、おすすめの方で。はい。あ、そういうことですね。わかりました。じゃあ、ちょっとカメラに見せてもいいですかちょっと見せますね。オッケー、
from here on, I'll try and take you guys into the changing room. But I'm not quite sure how the connection is going to be. So we might get some stuttering. Just uh, bear with me. Okay, let's see if we still have you guys rolling. Looks good for now. Alright, I'm going to try and put you guys down since we can't film in the changing room. Yeah, no one of you said that you can't see the changing room, so that means I can't film in the changing room. So, yeah, you guys have to wait outside, I guess. So, this is to Okay, guys, how's it now? Okay, guys, I need you to be quick and type now whether you can see this changing room or not. And the last comment I got from Kitsune is just saying hearing you. And Ken said fine, but I don't know what exactly is fine. So please be a little bit specific, guys, so I can tell whether you guys can see the changing room and hear me properly. This is goo? What do you mean with goo? <laughs> Alright. Okay. Lots of people are saying it's good. So let's try this one. Yeah, just a little So I heard this working. Yeah? We can see? Okay. Is it good or is it okay? Here's the question. Hi. Okay, now let's see. Okay, well, right guys, it looks like no one can actually see anything and get a lot of, it's not working at all. So in that case, we have to try and Try it here. やっぱ電波がいかないっぽいんですね。なんか頑張ってても Okay, well, it looks like you have to do this a little bit from the distance then. よし。そうですね。残念ながらあんまりこっちにくくっちゃうとここコンクリートでいけないっぽいんで。とりあえず長い中間行って、そうですね。ちょっと待ってください。ごめんなさい。ごめんなさい。何回も出入り。そうなんですよね。It's <笑> concrete, so it's a bit hard. Oh, hi everyone. Okay, there's another lady. See, some people are saying it's it's working. Crescent is saying it's not working. Yeah. All right. あの、鏡で映ってます。ごめんなさい。すみません。そうです、そうです。全然あの。もうやってます。すみません。はい。行きますよ。<笑><笑> はい。Alright. So, so think about it, we had the underwear layer, now we have another layer. Okay, now we have the cute ladies up in there. Okay, so first one string goes under my chest to make sure it all stays well in place. It's go it's actually pretty tight. You should be able to still breathe, but you shouldn't be able to get like three fingers in. If at all, maybe one. 
but um, they know exactly the, how, how strong it has to be. Right. Don't forget, I already have probably six towels around my waist. Okay, now I'm going to go to the next one. 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 But the big difference is that the material is, is thinner, as you could see it at the start of the stream. You kind of can see it through. Oh, this is classy. Again, you have to kind of match the length of the kimono with your body type and size. Again, I'm a bit curvy, so I'm always causing a little bit of trouble here. Okay. You can tell that they're both experienced in this. They're both giving each other advice of how they want it tied. What do you think? In case any of you guys is wondering, in Japan, we are all still wearing masks to protect the people around us. So it's already a very different feel from the yukata because with the yukata you only have one layer, but with the kimono you have this pretty silk layer that I showed you guys. And a pretty silk layer. You actually show the collar at the top. I'll show you this in a moment. Oh, we have a check in. Oh, that was loud. Welcome into the stream. So, I currently am filming it also with my second phone. So, you guys should maybe be able to see that later in the edited video that I'm also working on today for you guys. I'm like holding my breath a little bit. I'm not sure if you guys can actually see me over there. Well, but it's definitely, it, it, you can tell it's already a massive change to the Yukata class wise. This one looks a lot more classy. And there's a lot of like, you put, it's not a, like a clothing item that you put on and then you're done. It's a lot of like shifting it a little bit, seeing if the fold is right, shifting it a little bit, seeing if the fold is right, making sure this fits. This, so that's why you actually need help. You can't easily wear this by yourself. You do need help. One person is good if they can help you. Sometimes two people is even better. I've had a couple of kimono fittings where actually two people come and two people just fit. It's actually important. I always do the thing where I lift my arms up. Just lift 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 up. Then I can give him a hug. It's important that you don't lift your arms up while they're doing that because that can again change the shape. So ideally what you want to do is have your arms as loose as possible, but I end up putting my arms up anyways. Oh wow, this is already so different from what I wore last time. Oh, 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 oh. And again, both of them are going round now and checking that all the, the top layer and the bottom layer that they align just right. 
this is the point when you're trying to fix everything perfectly into space before you then add the OB. So again, this one is actually only going to get held together right now with two ropes. The first rope under my chest and the second rope under my chest. There's also a couple of clips and pins that they're putting into place right now. Those are to make sure that whatever they put in place stays into place. Again, you can see those two people. Feel a little bit like a princess. Now. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, that's not good. Yeah, that's not good. Yeah, I'm amazed how people in the old days were actually wearing this out. I can now totally understand why people faint in the summer heat. But I can see, I mentioned earlier, the material is see-through, right? I can actually see through the first layer. I'm going to show you in a moment. Yeah. Okay, there's another clip now on my right hip. We barely, <laughs> we barely getting it in here. Okay, now there's a waste time. Getting the pink waste time now. Yeah. Yeah, pink waist tie now again to keep that all in place so they fit the perfectly feel like I'm some sort of art piece right now. On a good name, I'm like some shirt. Well one thing I can say, definitely my tummy is hidden now. <laughs> It's interesting with the um the OB, it sits so close underneath your chest that it almost hides like the bottom of it. Oh, really. and now the beautiful, beautiful real OB, the summer OB that we mentioned, it's its turn. Just want to say thank you to everyone one more time for the support at the start of the stream. I didn't even know you could do all of that. It's just an interesting thing. Cool. I'm going to say. I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, so one layer goes round and that has the the path and the gold and silver hidden. It's really hard. Oh, oh, oh. It's so bossy. Bossy. Oh, yeah, this looks cool. I feel like a lady now. So just the step, we're already at, oops, okay. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I feel like that scene in the, uh, <laughs> in Pirates of the Caribbean, where they're tying her corset. Oh, I'm Oh, they prepped all the equipment and accessories for the summer too. So. Tamani, o kyakusama mukai ni iku te doi koto desu ka? もう1回してになるんです。あ、そうなんですね。あと、あと1つのテンポがあるってことですか？そうなんですね。<笑>
Okay, Biwa Kimono has actually two branches. I didn't know that, so there's another one. Yeah. Yeah, I learned something new too. Okay, there's now. After the sash, we have now another rope. Nice to get inside into place to keep everything. Okay, the first clips are coming out. Apparently there's some sort of pillow that I'm also going to be wearing. Wow. Oh, there is a pillow. Ooh. Okay, there's something on my back now that is for the bow. And it's like a little pillow. Ooh. And she's actually tying the bow around it. Again, you can't do that yourself. You need someone to help you with this. <laughs> <laughs> There's another thing I can go pop into the back of my arch. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. That's <laughs> Interesting to hear them both give advice to each other how to best tie it. There's not even another sash on top and like a golden yellow color. I'm not quite sure what that is there for. And both keeping count of all the layers and sashes. And they have a sash to bind and check. There's one, two, three, four. What is this one? Five? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I do feel like a princess who gets dressed. I think the, um, the bow on the back is usually something really difficult to do. But uh, oh, I guess I have to do it. It's like you're dressing me as a more. I would love to read your comments, but connection is not going to my second phone so um, I'm looking forward to seeing what you'll write after we watching the stream. Actually I will yeah. be how about you leave me a message as a Easter egg now. Because <laughs> then I'll have to through watch your messages later. Leave me some Easter eggs. It's kind of interesting that, that this yellow sash that comes in, I thought it was going to be to show, but now she's kind of starting to hide it underneath my hobby, so maybe it's just like a little bit of a show. This is already way different than the other. Okay.
ちょっと見せる感じですね。あと、あとこれも、もう少し入れます。あ、そうなんですね。はい、ここのままで。あんまり見せるものではなかったんですか。ちょっと、あの、あんまり見せたらね、あの。ちょっと、どうかな。少し、こう、あの、少し入れます、中へ。少し出るような感じのが素敵です。あ、そうなんですね。はい、okay, the yellow part that is sitting underneath my chest right now.、Um, you're gonna see that once I show you later. You kind of turn it around. And then you kind of hide it again, which I find interesting. You go for all that trouble, but then you kind of hide it perfectly again. I will definitely not be able to fit lunch in here. <laughs> これ帯締めですか帯締めですね。String in the middle is called 帯締め。That's a summer version too, so again, the material has holes to let some air pass in them. Okay, one flash is growing now, so that was only to keep it in place. Ooh. Now I realize I should not have eaten so much for breakfast. I regret every bit of my breakfast now. Back around. Ooh, we were almost there, guys. It's more c o r r e c t Ah, so much, isn't it? So much, isn't it? So, with the rope that's around the obi, there's a way of how to put it in. If you put it in <laughs> the wrong way, you, that's how you wear it for a funeral. So, you shouldn't get it wrong. It has to like point up if it's not tall for a funeral. Oh dear.、So、can, can that it's, so that you can do a lot of things wrong already just with the string that's in front of your stomach. To get it wrong. You have to be also bigger. Okay, we're pushing in the top thing. So, I'm going to put it on the top of the top. I'm going to put it on the top of the Yeah, the, the yellow sash we took out again and we, we, we put it back in. There's just a minor difference. I, with my I spy with my little eye, I wouldn't even see the difference. But I practiced cleaning this up. Person knows that there was a difference and it wasn't quite right. Okay. Okay. Good job. Woohoo. Did you get the same thing? でき,できましたかできましたよ ?OK, we're done!Alright! あら、やったね、サマリー。ただただだだ。Alright. ありがとうございます。どっちの靴がいいですか先ほどの方が。袋が入ったし、どういうかなと思ったり。
。ええええええ。ああ、そうなんですね。ああ、ええええええ。ええー、っと、えー、見た目的これなんですけど、履きやすい方に行こうかな。<笑>あ,あ、すみません、ごめんなさい、さい。ああ、はい、これと。<笑>えー、ごめんなさい。あ、これいいですね。私の方が、そ前の方が履きやすいです。足が若干はみ出てるんですけど、大丈夫ですかあ、そうなんですね。あのね、日本の着物は、あの、うんうん。カラトカラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カラト、カちょっと待ってください。すごーい。おお。なるほど、こうだい、けにすいだ。こんで、はい、だいすじん。おお、まいがし。いや。I'm not wearing g a i t e r These ones are g a i t e r These ones here are zori. They're very, very different. And you're supposed, your feet are supposed to poke out a little bit at the back. <sighs> and glitch the digital demon. Thank you for the $2 donation. All right. I would like to show you guys how I'm getting my hair done. I just hope that the concrete wall will allow me to keep you guys in the chat. That's what I'm a little bit worried about. Yes. I still have you here, so let's see. Oh, looks like it's working. Okay. So, this is the, the room where they put, where they make the、um, hair makeup. Hair, well, the hair setting, which is also very, very cool. Hi, Onigashimasu. Yours. Might change the camera to wide lens so you guys can see this better. Too wide. There we go. Ultra wide it is. Okay. Yes. Very good, i s n t it? Excuse me. Is this okay? 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 There we go. All right. Might need a little chair somewhere here. ここに椅子一個置いといていいですかああ。そしたらなんかいけるかなと。願い。願いを。Okay, I'm gonna try and post you guys here now. Alright, let's try that. <laughs> 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 so, now I'm going to check the time. So, 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 I'm going to check Yeah, she said like the, the building has really thick walls, so there's not such a good reception in here. So we're trying to work around it. Also, obviously, I have not the, not the best, it's like the second best of the internet here in Japan, but apparently, it's not the best. I'll figure this out. Yay! はい、そうします。手外せるところに来たら、その瞬間に、あの、止まってるかどうかちょっとチェックします。ぜひ教えてください
そうなんですかじゃあ今チェックできそうな瞬間だったら教えてください一回ピン止めるとき<笑>そのとき<笑>行った方が少しましょういいかなとは思いますありがとうございますちなみにつながってなさそうでしょうどうですかねさっきはちょっと動いたんですけど、カメラ移動してからまだチェックしてないんで。はい。ありがとうございます。よお。そうですね。よーし。A whole lot of pins in now, so we can go and check on you guys. Let's see. How are you guys doing? Is it working or is it not working? And okay, there's no not working there, so it seems like we are working. No, everyone's saying hi to Kuya. It's working. Okay, good. Thank you. <laughs> Man, that's always a challenge. So, I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to try and get a little bit of B roll in as well for you guys. But when we do the final video, <laughs> things like this makes me go, man, it's so different if you're doing it all by yourself to when you have someone to help you. Um, also, my breath is a little bit shorter. <laughs> Because of the corset. Hi, guys, over there. She's very gently looking after my hair because I mentioned at the start that currently my my scalp is so. Oh, Kami Kazari, Osuzume de. Uh, my phone won't connect to my Wi Fi, so I can't look at chat right now. Just give me a second. I can probably done with this one, and I'll be with you guys. We'll give you a full rundown of the outfit. です。
clear because oh, my scalp has been um, like red and not good for a while now. It's probably because I dyed it too much. So that's why I'm resting it up right now. Yep, too much bleach. There's a lot of like cute little bows and stuff all around. And I was asking for something that would go with this. So we're going a little bit more for a more classy look today. Kandashi is like a traditional one. You know that those are the things that are so expensive, remember from the Twitch stream? おお。色的になんか。どうしますか？なんか色的にそれでも大丈夫なんですかね？そうですね。うん。Trying to find some. There's so many cool accessories here. Some of them look expensive. どうしましょう。おすすめ、おすすめで。おお、いいですね。So trying to find the final touch here piece. We might go for something big instead of going small because I like go big or bold or go home. <laughs> this one looks pretty. <laughs> I hope that's not gonna hurt too. Hi! Let's do it. Hi! Oi! Looks good to me. Okay. 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 Just like it's, I'm not gonna make it too tight like I usually would, and I'm like, that's totally fine. Just keep it nice and floppy and like, fluffy and simple. Most importantly, it looks good for now, so I can show it to you guys. Oh! Oh! <laughs> All right. Hi, I'm gonna. うん。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。はい。オールライト、ウィンナーズチュメイクイットオールインタイムビフォーザカスタマーズアライブ。そう、ハッピーアバウトイト。アウトプットイトガイズクローザーアンドリードザイマ
whenever I so straighten my entire fringe, or will I regret this in a moment? Not so bad, not so bad. There we go. Fringe. Last touch. We are done. We're done, we're done. Okay, oh, okay. Let me, defeat. Let me just do this one more time. Here we go. Okay. All right. We are done, guys. Let's turn it off. The transformation is complete. <laughs> Let me grab you guys. All right. Let's see. Hey. Hey, guys. <laughs> so here is our kimono transformation. Thank you for being patient and staying through it, even through the, the bits and bobs when it wasn't working. So... Let me quickly give you a whole roundup of the outfit, okay? Yes. So, you now finally get to see the full thing. Ta-da-da. <laughs> so, we learned something today. We learned that there is not just yukata in summer, there's also summer kimono. And this is the one that I'm having here. So let me come closer to you guys. I, saw, I showed it at the start of the stream. It is a see-through sheer mesh material. So you can see the white through. It is really, really, you can see even the light, how it falls through on this material, right? It's very, very, very different. Now the one underneath this layer generally would be the same kind of material too, but today we're going with this one because it has a nicer color. Showing off this color is part of the experience. Now one of the things that takes a lot of time is this one here the back, the obi. <laughs> Thank you all for your nice comments, guys. Look at this. This one took a mighty time to fold. There's a lot, a lot of hard work that fits into folding this thing. There's like a little pillow here on the side. I'm like, I kid you not, there's a pillow here on the side that keeps this all up. And as earlier mentioned, if you could hear it, this little string that you tie around here, it's so important, you need to again to know how to tie it. If you tie it wrong, it's the type that people tie for funerals. If you tie it like one of them, it has to like go look upwards for normal tying and downwards for funerals. For me, it just looks like a knot in a string. So there's a bit of difference there. Hold on, let me see if I can. So this, there are no customers in store and no one's close. So let me quickly show you this properly like this. <laughs> My skin is all light red. Ta-da! I'm gonna go to the side. <laughs> this part here has the most, um, takes the most time to prep, okay? Um, this time takes the most, this part here takes the most time to prep because it has like so, so, so many layers. And again, I mentioned it earlier in the stream. This one, you're trying to make everything look the same. So the top, the middle of the bottom, all of it should be one straight line. So that's the opposite from Western cultures where you're trying to usually emphasize this area and then make this one nice and tight, petite. Like corsets make this one petite. In Japan, it's like to, to balance it all out and give you that kind of straight look here. That takes a lot of time. The curvier you are, the more time that will take, but it's not impossible. We've proven it today. It is very much possible to balance it all out. I'm amazed how like the, uh, the silver and the gold reflects on the light here. It's so pretty. <laughs> that is uh, how it works and how it all comes together. Right. <laughs> that was our kimono makeover today. And since the audio is out of sync, I'm going to put on a mask like I start now. 
um, I tried my very best to deliver you this kimono makeover. Thank you so much for holding on to it and watching it through with me till the end. Um, oh, the hair at the back, the hair is well done. Hold on, check that out. Check out my hair bling. <laughs> So yeah, so we got that all. <laughs> so yes, um, don't forget a parasol. Yeah, I'll I'll need a parasol because it is very very hot outside. So I'm gonna go film a little bit more for you guys here on YouTube as well. So there's gonna be a beautiful YouTube video soon as well. So yes, <laughs> I know the neck birdie, the neck, the perfect the neck for female. The neck is supposed to droop a little bit down. For gents, it's usually up against here. For females, you're supposed to show a little bit of the neck. I know. <laughs> Thank you for taking us with you. Thank you for being here. I hope you enjoyed a very, very special stream. Again, this was BY Kimono. If you, in the future, are able to come to Japan and mention that you you know them because you've seen my stream, I'm sure you, you can get maybe an accessory or something that they will add to it. So that might be another thing. <gasps> Doug Outlaw, thank you for the five dollars, and Glitch the Digital Demon, thank you for the two dollars. Thank you for the support of the YouTube stream. I haven't streamed on YouTube for about a year now, I think. So I really appreciated that you guys are supporting the YouTube streams. Thank you guys. <laughs> it was really fun. So yeah, the nape of the neck. Oh my! I oh know that's the that's really important for kimonos as well. That nape of the neck, the unaju. <laughs> Yes, oh my, oh my. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go now take tons of pictures um, and uh, gonna take some for Instagram and like a whole ton for Patreon as well. So, thank you guys so much for, for all the support, for being here, for enjoying the stream, for making it special. I hope it was special for you guys too, as it was special for me. And uh, I wish you all the, all the best for the rest of your day. It's, it's night where you guys are, but I'm glad I could take you along. So thank you so much for tuning in and I'll catch you soon for another video. If you haven't seen the video that went up yesterday, be sure to check that one out too. It's at the tiniest, tiniest hotel room in Osaka and there's more cool stuff coming here soon as well. So thank you so much for being here. You guys are awesome and have a good evening, guys. Thank you guys. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Thank you.